Are you curious what's going on with your home and your neighborhood in Pelican Bay? Well, that's what we're talking about today, so you're going to want to stick around. Hey, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Veronica Edwards with EXP Realty. And I post new videos each and every week about living in and around the Daytona Beach area. Things to do, places to eat. So if this is something you would like to hear more about, hit the subscribe button down below and the bell to be notified when new videos come out. Hey everyone, it's me, Veronica Edwards, your Pelican Bay specialist and neighbor. If you're like me, you might want to know what's going on with your home and your neighborhood. So I thought I'd do a quick little video on our neighborhood and give you some little reports if you like. The first one is this neighborhood report on Pelican Bay. And you can see here, as I've mentioned in a previous video, the average value of our homes here in Pelican Bay is still around 200000 compared to Daytona and Volusion all across the board. Over the last 12 months, over the last year, the market changes as it does. And also I wanted to point out, if you come down here to the own and rent, we have across the board, I think ownership is up pretty good, which is great for all of us. And if you are happen to be renting and watching this, please reach out to me as there is some First time home buyer incentives often going on. I'd love to help you out with that and getting you into home ownership, which is always a terrific investment, in my opinion. I see here in Daytona though, it's the rental is actually up higher. I think that's due to all the apartment complexes. I used to own a property management company and we had a lot of the large apartment complexes Primarily, they were located in Daytona Beach. We get a lot of tenants in Daytona. We were constantly in Daytona renting out apartment complexes and houses. So I think that's why that is at 55. If you want a copy of this report, go ahead and email me. My email information is down below, and I'll be happy to send this report over to you. As it goes in, a little bit more about just about our neighborhood the population, education level, just all kinds of little odds and ends about what your neighbors are up to. I also have this market activity report. Report. This will be in a link down below. You can go ahead and opt in to get this report. Of course, if you ever have something in particular you want to know about or a special report, man, just let me know. I'm happy to do it. You can contact me by phone text or email, whatever is easiest for you. But this little market activity report is, a, is as of today, which is March 12th, 2020. It's about everything going on, again, specific to Pelican Bay, I ran this for. And they even have, like, we still have some distressed properties. If this happens to be one of you, please reach out to me. It might not be too late to still save you. It's worth looking into. I've helped many, many people get out of foreclosure. Anyways, this report will go down a little bit more into what's active, pending, and recently sold. Again, as of today, March 12th, 2020, we have eight listings, 10 pending, and 10 recently sold. And then it goes over a little bit more in detail. And then if you scroll down, it goes even more in detail of what's listed, where at, how much. And you scroll down some more, you got the pending and the sold. Again, this report will be linked down below too. If there's anything I can do to help you, please let me know as I'm always happy to help. So now you know a little bit more about the market as of March 2020, in particular in your neighborhood Pelican Bay. Please click on the link below in the comment section to get your Pelican Bay market activity report. Thank you for watching my video, and if you ever see me out walking around in the neighborhood, please stop and say hello, as I'd love to meet you. Mm -hmm.